Hi there! Yeah, you! Well, you're talking to a now, champ. <laughs> My name is Kiyu. Nice to meet you. Right. We'll try that again later. Look, dude. Are you gonna be alright? Looks like you're having some trouble holding it together over there. Psh, that's a fat load of shit and you know it. I could see how uncomfortable you are right now from space. Hmm, wait. You know what? This might actually work. Yeah. Yeah! Oh man, this is your lucky day, buddy! Listen, I gotta go, but we'll meet again real soon. Trust me. Night! Hey you, rise and shine, we've got work to do! I said get up! No way, dude. No time to waste. Don't you recognize this adorable face? <laughs> it's Kiyu from the bar. Clever disguise, right? I can change my hair any color I want. It's pretty sweet. If you can't tell by now, I'm a fairy. Well, a love fairy to be exact. Good question, I'm glad you asked. You see, as a love fairy, it's my job to help poor saps like you out with the ladies. It's just... Mm, what I do. I don't like to brag, but I'll have you know I have a very impressive track record. All of my previous clients are basically walking babe magnets now. You though... <clears throat> Let's just say you will be my greatest accomplishment yet. <laughs> no, but seriously. We need to get started right away. Tell me, how many dates have you been on? Oh my god, it's worse than I thought, isn't it? Alright, grab your shit. We're going on a date right now. Someone has to show you the ropes. I know a place nearby that's open pretty late. You'll love it. Or not, I don't care. Alright, I'll try to make this quick. This is the date grid. These little pieces are called tokens. You earn affection by matching three or more of the circular tokens horizontally or vertically. For a successful date, you have to fill the affection meter before you run out of moves. Go ahead, give it a shot. Match those orange ones with the crescent shape in the middle of the grid. See? Easy! Each of the four types of affection tokens represents a particular trait. The orange ones represent romance, blue is talent, green is flirtation, and red is sexuality. Pay attention to which trait your date prefers. It'll go a long way. Of course, matching four or five tokens will get you even more affection. I'll show you. Match those four sexuality tokens in the bottom right of the grid, the red ones. What's next? Oh right! Let me cover the other token types real quick. The pink hearts are passion tokens. Matching those will raise your date's passion level. The higher her passion level is, the more affection you'll earn. The gold bells are joy tokens. 
you'll get an extra move by matching those. Very useful. The broken heart tokens are bad news. Seriously, avoid matching those as best you can. Finally, the teardrops are sentiment tokens. Matching those gives you, well, sentiment. You need sentiment in order to use date gifts. And seeing as how you don't have any date gifts, I'm guessing I need to explain that too. Here, I'll hook you up with one of mine. It's on the house. Like I said, you'll need sentiment to use it. So go ahead and match those three sentiment tokens in the leftmost column, the teardrops. Okay, now go ahead and give that date gift to me. Cool, huh? There are like a ton of different date gifts that you can get too. They each have a unique effect on the date and can be extremely useful in combination. Oh, <laughs> and thanks to a little fairy magic, you'll never actually lose them. So you can use them on your next date too. <laughs> Is that cool or what? Alright, alright, I've gone on long enough. I'll let you finish up the date so you can get the hang of it. Oh, and don't worry, I won't let you fail this one. I'm not that mean. Oh shit, it's morning already? We are way behind schedule. Okay, check it out. I have one last thing to give you, and this is important. Introducing the latest in Love Fairy technology, the Honey Bee 4.0. The honeybee is an essential lifeline for any player on the go. It automatically registers the info of new girls you meet and can even track their location. You can organize your inventory, buy new gifts, upgrade your traits. It's awesome! We don't have time to go over every feature, but you're a big boy. You can figure it out. To access the honeybee, all you have to do is right-click at pretty much any time. Or if you're weird, you can use that button at the top of the screen. <laughs> go ahead! Break that bad boy open. Okay, great! I think that's it for now. Let's get out there and talk to some broads. I said, 
Let's go talk to some broads. That's what I like to hear. Now if you want to meet a hot chick, you gotta go where the hot chicks are. I've done some scouting and I have a few ideas of where to start. It depends what type of girls you're into. We can check out the university, the mall, the gym, the park, or the nearby cafe. What'll it be? Good choice, Rookie. Couldn't have picked it better myself. All right, ready? Get your game face on. Up again? That's exactly what you asked for! Are you joking? Bitch, do I look like I'm joking? How am I supposed to walk around like this? You're fucking loco! This is how I always cut your nasty ass hair! Nasty ass hair? Ugh! Don't even! Look who's talking, skank! No, bitch! My hair isn't dried out and reeking of smoke, okay? Whatever, ho! Why don't you go get knocked up again? You need to turn around and walk away. What's wrong? Did I hurt your whore feelings? Turn around and walk away. Gladly. At least I won't have to look at your whore face anymore. Fucking whore ass bitch needs to learn. Ooh, she's a little feisty one, huh? Oh yeah, don't worry. They can't see or hear me. I'm just a figment of your imagination. Plot twist! <laughs> nah, I'm crazy real. I just hid myself from everyone so I can give you advice on the sideline. <laughs> this is what we refer to as a mega bitch. Confidence is key here. She has to know you're in charge and her bullshit isn't going to phase you. So whatever you do, just stay cool. Could you move, please? You're kind of in my way. Uh, ew. What are you even doing at the mall anyway? Besides creeping on girls. <laughs> Is that so? Well... You're going to have to do a lot better than that. Sorry, but you did put in effort, I guess. And you are kind of cute. I'll tell you what, if you're lucky, maybe we can go get high sometime. You down? Nice. Name's Audrey. Get at me if you want to make things crazy. Now, if you don't mind, could you get the fuck out of my way? No way! You did it! Well, with my help, of course. I gotta admit, I did not expect you to pull that off. Beginner's luck. Don't let it go to your head. By the way, that other chick that was here just a second ago? Since she was in range, the honeybee started tracking her location too. So after you're done here with this girl, you can go catch up with her, too. Just bust out the honeybee and check out the girl finder screen. I'm pumped. You pumped? Yeah, you're pumped. Go get him. I'll be around if you need me. <laughs> what am I saying? Of course you need me. Work? <laughs> Bitch, I'm already going to school. What the fuck do you expect? Yeah, yeah. You're lucky I'm in a good mood today. Okay, I'm here. So now what? Whatever. 
something. So, what kind of shit are you on? Can I tell you a secret? I'm high right now! <laughs> you know what I've been wondering? What's your biggest turn-off, huh? So you don't have to worry about me. Fun is pretty much my deal. So, I'm like, starving. Like, to death? It's kind of a problem. Fucking disgusting. Oh man, I love this shit. So here's a question. What are you supposed to do when you're bored? yourself useful and go get me something to eat seriously hook a bitch up with some food
eating always makes me want to smoke. Ugh, gross! That's fucking disgusting. Since you're here, you can answer this for me. Do you still talk to any of the girls you used to fuck? What the fuck is that supposed to mean? So, I'm like, starving. Like, to death? It's kind of a problem. Uh, yeah. Okay, bye. Yo, I didn't expect to see you here today, Tiffany. Yeah, my English Lit class was canceled. Trying to make good use of the time. Hey, listen, thanks so much for watching Philip the other day. I know it was last minute. No, don't even mention it. I love to hang out with Billy. He's my little buddy. Did he give you any trouble? Nope, like an angel. An angel? Are you sure you were watching the right kid? <laughs> <laughs> I know I still owe you two, so don't worry. I should be getting my paycheck tomorrow. Shh, I won't hear of it. I was more than happy to help out. Nonsense. I'm not taking no for an answer. Too late. <laughs> Have a good workout. Hey, get back here. This isn't over. Man, will you get a load of these two? I'd kill to have tits like that. This chick is clearly out of your league, but there may be hope. She's probably looking for a decent guy because of that baby mama drama. So just try not to be an ass for like five minutes. Oh, she's looking over this way. Showtime. Hey, are you finished with that machine? I have one set left to jam out. Awesome, thanks so much. Really? OMG! I've done a couple of local commercials, but I never thought I'd be recognized! You must be new here. I don't think we've met before, right? I like to think I know all the regulars here on a first name basis. You could say I'm a little obsessed with this place, I guess. <laughs> My name's Kiana. Will I be seeing you here more often? Great, I'm counting on it. Oh, dude, you know what? You have to try one of the yoga classes they do here. The instructor is awesome. I think you'd dig it. If you like being in a room with a bunch of sweaty girls, that is. <laughs> I think that's an awesome idea. You ready? Thanks for inviting me out. Such a nice day for the market.
Just great. Can we go now? What?